13 years ago, on this day, 13 years ago, my district, Amadou Diallo, was shot 41 times. On that day, the officers screamed gun and shot 41 times. Here we are, 13 years later, and although there's been a lot done between that day and now, to strengthen police community relations, to change policy, to do positive things in communities, 13 years later, here we are, with the same tragedy happening in the same community. So what's wrong with this picture? Why is it that when we take one step forward, we allow these incidents to take us 10 steps back? 13 years later, and we can't get it right. Mayor Bloomberg has been in office, now this is his third term. What has he done to the school system? He says the numbers are not there, the schools are failing, I'm gonna close the schools, I don't care about what other issues are impacting, I'm just gonna change everything around. And he's unilaterally, unilaterally used mayoral control to do that with our schools. Well, Mr. Mayor, why can't you do that with your NYPD? Why do our men and women from our community, black and Latino, young men and women have to suffer in order for you guys to finally realize we need to do something? 13 years later, we haven't done enough. So what is it going to take? When is this going to stop? As an elected official, we have a number of bills, we have policies we propose, but we can't do this alone. We need this administration to own up to its mistakes. We know that not every officer is a bad officer. Matter of fact, most of them are law-abiding great officers who do the right thing. And all it takes is one trigger-happy lone wolf to ruin it all, to take a life in our community. It doesn't seem to happen in a lot of other people. It happens in ours. How many times do we have to bury one of our own and beg for justice before something tangible is done? We don't need community meetings. We don't need to inform people. We don't need, you know, lip service or a visit. We need policy change. We need better training for these officers. I don't care if they've been in the force 10, 15, 20 years. Every so often, the same way they go and practice at the range on their aim, they should be getting sensitivity training, cultural training. Every officer and every priest should spend some time in community affairs duty. Let them work with communities and their justice the justice system that they serve has a, has protocol. We have we have charges for some crimes. We have we want peace in our neighborhoods. We want to get the drugs and the guns off our streets. But we want that justice system to function. We don't need that justice to be served by their trigger. That's what has to change. So we expect changes. We don't want lip service. We need policy changes and better training for these officers and get the ones that don't deserve to wear the blue and wear the shield off our streets. Yeah.